Writing a literature review is an inevitable part of being a graduate student. So before spending hours of your time working on a project involving a literature review, it helps to understand what a literature review is and why it is important. You may need to do a literature review as a part of a course assignment, a capstone project, or a master's thesis or dissertation. No matter the context, a literature review is an essential part of the research process. Some important functions of a literature review are that it helps you to understand a research topic and develop your own perspective on a problem. Not only that, it lets you show your instructor or thesis committee what you know about the topic. Your instructor or advisor may assume you know what a literature review is and that you understand what they are expecting from you. You might hear phrases like, what does the literature show us? Connect your ideas to the literature. Survey the literature on the topic. Well, before you can review the literature, you need to make sure you know what is meant by the literature. A good definition of the literature is that it is a collection of all the scholarly writings on a topic. These writings can be in the form of scholarly, peer-reviewed articles, books, and other sources like conference proceedings. These may be called annual meetings or conventions. The literature also includes dissertations written by other graduate students. Collectively, these make up the literature. Visually, the literature might look like this. Often there are major works that have been written on a topic, and then other later works that build on them. These later works tend to be extending or responding to the original papers in some way. Basically, the literature is a continuously evolving network of scholarly works that interact with each other. As you do your own research, you'll begin to understand the relationships in this evolving web and how your own ideas connect to it. Many different lines of study contribute to the story you are trying to write. Your job in the literature review is to see where all the loose ends are in the various fields of study that are most closely related to what you want to do, and then to figure out what needs to be done next. The background to any good story has to be explained carefully or the reader doesn't know why one thing is important and something else is not. So how do you turn a network of articles into a cohesive review of the literature? How do you find and tell the story behind your research topic? Reviewing the literature is like participating in a conversation. As you read and evaluate articles, you begin to understand how they are connected and how they form the story that the authors are telling. Then you start to formulate your own response or contribution. This process, discovering relationships in the literature and developing and connecting your own ideas to it, is what helps you turn a network of articles into a coherent review of the literature.